25 gigahertz bands available under the conditions already approved by the European Commission in its proposal and we also adopted we also made available the 790 to 872 megahertz band available the so-called digital dividend with harmonized technical conditions this is to be available before 2015 As an extension and a complement to the regulation that I mentioned before, we've also been working in Spain on additional rules for a, a future framework, but one coming as soon as possible, for investment uh, and building up uh, business models uh, for people who are players in the market. And I want to tell you in this connection that we are about to pass a royal decree regulating the multiples of, uh, of uh, terrestrial uh, television uh, after the television frequencies after the uh, analog frequencies uh, closed down, uh, which is going to be in 2015 at the latest and the cabinet uh, on Friday last week uh, approved a, a sustainable economy bill which will now be sent to Parliament That includes a deep breaching, uh, cross cutting reform of many aspects uh, of the economy. It's going to represent a further step in the modernization of the Spanish economy, and it includes a number of measures about the spectrum. For example, this bill already contains something which the regulation said could happen, but now the bill says it will happen. which is technological neutrality in the 900 megahertz band so that uh, in that band you can give, offer third or fourth or future new generations of mobile technology and the law the bill uh, also extends the secondary market to the 900 1800 megahertz and 2.1 gigahertz bands and to the 3.5 band as well and lastly let me stress the effort that is being made in Spain on the switch over from analog to digital television with the consequent freeing up of the top of the spectrum by way of a dividend. This is happening because in Spain it was decided that some of this uh, spectrum dividend should be used to increase the number of television channels uh, on offer because there was uh, already a demand for local and regional and national channels which was way above uh, the European average. We've also taken this opportunity f to plan once the process is finished uh, to plan granting each uh, national channel a complete multiplex uh, which struck us has the best way uh, to plan for progressive introduction of new services like high definition or three-dimensional television. Uh, that first plan of ours was in 2005 and since then of course technology has moved on and decisions have emerged from the ITU conference 
So it then became important to free up some of the television band for mobile services. And a similar decision was taken at European level, at which point we started in Spain uh, to work to ensure that there could be spectrum available uh, in that band, despite the crowding of it. In fact, the Commission's uh, decision on harmonized technical conditions for the use of this band uh, has just been uh, passed, at, just been transposed at national level. Although this first needs to be passed by the Commission, they, it seems as if the final approval could happen in April, which will be an important date for this further planning process that all countries now have to embark upon to make that bandwidth available to that band available to new technologies. With that decision and with the transition plan from analog to digital and with the decree that I mentioned before about the final channel allocation for television, Spain will become one of the first European countries to finalize the transition to digital television and also in taking the legal steps uh, uh, for the use of the digital dividend. We are in fact about to conclude the uh, definitive uh, close down of analog broadcasting, which is happening these very days. In fact, just today a number of channels will go off the air and tomorrow and the next day uh, and the day after some more. And the 2nd of April, 10 days time in other words, will be the final day for analog television in Spain. This has been a very technologically complex process uh, with a very important social dimension